Welcome to SOCAP 19. <laughs> when, I, when I look out at this room, I, um, I've had the privilege and honor of being part of this community for eight years now. And I know that among you, there are many who predate me, who have been here for all 12 years of SOCAP. Let's see, anyone here? Predates eight years, let's say. You don't have to be all 12. And then I know there's many of you who are new this year. Who's new? Who's for SOCAP? Wow, awesome. You're the best at attending sessions. You win. Um, <laughs> thank you for adding your voice and for being here. And I know it's a big commitment to take the week and to get here. So thank you for being here. I'm also thinking about the people from this community who are joining us from afar via live stream. And they've been really on my mind this year. This is such a valuable room. The people in this room have ideas and organizations and resources that are making amazing change in the world. But there's also so many people who are not in this room. And I, this year I've really been thinking of them. I believe deeply in the power of convening, of bringing valuable strangers together to create unlikely allies. And I'm so excited and inspired every year by the collaboration that takes place here and what springs from it. But, uh, well, and this year, apologies. So uh, when we're all here together, you know many people already, and you're here to meet new people as well. We've partnered with BrainDate this year to create a topic marketplace where you can find others to connect with and share with. And I encourage you to go on there and find, meet some new people, not just the people you know while you're here. But I also believe that this can't just be an event. It needs to be a movement. If we're gonna unlock the potential of markets to drive impact, it's gonna take all of us. And what that really is gonna require is a culture shift. The dominant culture around finance and money and business is unsustainable and it's being challenged regularly. But shifting, a real culture shift, doesn't require just events like this. It requires art and media and influence and stories. And we have great stories in this room, but I'm not sure that we're sharing them widely enough. A few years ago, we created SOCAP 365 to take this show on the road. And the amazing thing to me was that two thirds of the people who showed up weren't even on our mailing list. They'd heard about it from a friend and they showed up, it sounded interesting. A year ago, we started a podcast, Money and Meaning. How many of you have listened to our podcast? way more of you should, it gets over 2,000 downloads a month. It's incredible. And so I'm just constantly reminded of the people who are searching for this conversation and have never even heard of impact investing, much less heard of SOCAP. But I know that all of the people who care about climate change would be devastated to know that they're invested in fossil fuels. And I know that so many people who are out protesting for criminal justice would be horrified to know that their banks where they keep their deposits and their, do their checking and banking are lobbying on behalf of private prisons. I also know that they would be inspired to invest in with whatever they can invest into the amazing climate entrepreneurs that we have here and use their influence to advance racial equity. This can't be a conversation for the 1%. It needs to be a conversation for everyone. I titled this plenary, A Global Movement That Matters to Millions. And I hope that you're inspired by the lineup of speakers and the ambition that's within this room, the change that's already happened and the change that we're aspiring to. You are part of a movement. So let's make the most of this time here together at SOCAP, and then let's go out and tell it to millions. Share these stories, make it as accessible as we can, and build the movement at the intersection of money and meaning. Thank you for joining us here.